Hello there and welcome back to The Walking Dead. Let's pick this back up from where we left on then, shall we? Yes, we shall. It was all a dream. <gasps> or not. Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Please, man! Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back there. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. You have to go back. My family's back there. Hey, you gotta listen to me. There's a herd coming. A massive one. And we... Yeah, and that's why we're driving away from it. Please, just stop, all right? You don't want me riled up, kid. Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Stop! Oh. Stop! Oh, shit! No, no, no! I'm not gonna make this. I'm not gonna make this worse. Go on, buddy. <sighs> I didn't shoot. <sighs> Fuck. <sighs> yeah. Lemon drink. <sighs> All right. That's good. Just keep looking forward. Look, I'm no threat to you, okay? I surrender. Well, that's obvious. Seeing how you didn't shoot that guy. Okay, now don't do anything stupid. Because I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. Oh, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Well done. Oh, shit. Yeah. You stopped it, all right. Tree fell slower than I thought it would. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look. I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me. This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked, and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522, and, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard, if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. Uh... That van is our home. It's all we got. That sounds like a no. How about you just give me directions like a normal person? How about I shoot you and take the van anyway? How about this you join us? For you. Let's go. Damn it, Clem. This really necessary? I don't know you. I don't trust you. And I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. 
Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. I'm recording. Fuck. Cool name. Ah. My mom just interrupted to get the dog. talk fine but how about you give me that gun back so i can at least defend myself for all i'd know you'd turn around and use it on me look i'm not gonna shoot you i didn't even shoot the guy who had me tied up but i know you thought about it yeah because he was fucking kidnapping me and taking me away from Wait, my family the herd caught up with us What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, it's just me on my own. Sounds kind of lonely if you ask me. Well, I didn't ask you. And, anyway, I prefer it like that. Come on, Clem, just join us. So, who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive, surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. I did whatever I had to do to protect them. Kept them out of trouble the best I could. Sucks. That sometimes it's not enough. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Same thing that happens to everyone. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. Don't make me regret this. Come on! That town will have power. <sighs> the wind turbine. There! It's a fucking settlement. Get to the gate! Keep going! They'll open up! Shit! Hey! Open up! I can't open the gate till you clear them out! Can't risk it! Understood. Francine, one of these days, those doors are going to close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No, 
Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there. Hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind. If you want to hang on to all your teeth, that is. Now head on in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. <laughs> yeah. It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old Damn. air strip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually, I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. No, no, this place is actually kind of charming. It's got walls all the way around, and, well, that thing. Yeah, like I said, this is a pretty cool place. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. If you guys make it this it. long, I I'm sure you know you'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go this way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since, well, you know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Hmm. Well done. Looks like someone's in the middle of a game. Then barkeep. I wonder if you got any whiskey. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what is worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20 year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? You want an autograph or something? <laughs> if I had a baseball, I'd take you up on it. But I'm fresh out. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm, don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Though all it takes is one good hand. Well, you've got He's, him there. He's got bullshit written all over him. <laughs> is that a fact? All right, I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. <laughs> Flip them. Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Oh, calm down, both <laughs> of you. Thanks for the advice, hon. How's about a drink? On my tab. Bottoms up. Wow, oh, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal, and it's done? What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. 
He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Yeah. Because I don't scare easy, all right? Damn right. So you better figure out a way to fix this. And I mean real fast. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. <laughs> I could have died because of his bullets. Oh, fucking believable. Look out! <laughs> oh, fuck you, Lottie. Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy. I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. We had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Drop the gun! Right now! Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? I got her back her up on it. Uh, I've, I've got time for this. It was an accident. I mean, I've got a fucking cut there, so she's justified. Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Oh, hey, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. Got some nerve coming in and fucking up my bar. He's just better because I... I'd have I helped him lose out. the game. Both of you. But Eli was a grade-A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey, thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um, that was cool of you. <laughs> I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. Well, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. The trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. Javier, pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. <sighs> I've never understood it. Yeah? Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> I'll give you that one. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? Look, things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. Best thing is probably for you two to leave town and get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... 
If there's anything I can do to help. Well, not that I have much to offer you, but I know a thing or two about losing family. They didn't want to get in trouble. We should find a way out anyway. I wouldn't want to make any trouble for you. This whole thing's been pretty messy. I hear you, but... Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're going to do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? Fair enough. We'll still get to the junkyard and All right. we should be able to Fair crack enough. them. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Sorry, I didn't hear any on hand. it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they can need a medic. Nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but... Well, we could leave tonight. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. If your family does need help, I'll be right there to give it. It's too risky, and if Muertos were to somehow surround us, we... Don't worry. It'll be fine. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah, she's, she's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. Yeah. Yeah. Trip, at the very least, from what we've seen, at least he's an honest guy. Her, she seems almost sort of naive in some ways. And while she is wanting us to get there as soon as we can, there's a fucking horde just outside the walls. <clears throat> Go in the morning. You're right. Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait and get a ride with him. Glad you're finally listening to reason. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It's gonna be a while before that herd passes. We might as well get some sleep. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. Draw in there, goofball. Can I see? <sighs> you know I'm no good at this game, but I'll try to guess what it is. Just give me a second. I'll figure it out. It's a doggy, right? It's me? <sighs> it looks just like me. Come on, can you say Clem, AJ? Give it a try. Clem. Not much of a talker, are you, goofball? Edith says you should be speaking by now, but... Don't worry about it. You'll talk when you're ready. That was weird. Clem, open up. It's me. Edith, what's wrong? The group from last week. They're back. And now they're armed. This is bad, Clem. Th there's a lot of them. Too many of them. I don't like the looks of it. What do they want from us? M more than we can give. And, and now they're angry. Just pack whatever you can. Be ready to run, just in case. They got a lot of cars and they're seriously pissed off. This is gonna get ugly. I know it.
And pack your stuff. When I get back, we gotta get the hell out. Shit, shit, shit. Very essentials. Come on. We fucking begged you, man. Our people are sick and starving. It didn't have well, to be uh, this way. You could have just given us some grub, some medicine. That's it. This is your fault. Y'all are just hoarding it for your condoms. Selves. Crayons. It. That's. Clem. Clem. <laughs> They're inside. We have to go now. What about the fuck she was doing with them? <laughs> oh, that's the guy from before. Just head for, for the woods. Give me AJ. No. No. Oh God. You're okay. You're okay. You're okay. He didn't get hit. Fucking shoot him! Shit. I was wondering where she got that cut. I didn't remember if I'd fucked up before when I was playing. Hey, Clem. We almost there. Hey, Clem. Yeah, we're close. I gotta say, I hope your people are safe and sound. Same. Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh, yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm gonna do. Though why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. I mean, she hardly even knows you. And you don't know her, for that matter. Makes a guy wonder, you know? Hey, I didn't ask her to. She did that all on her own. Yeah, well, I guess she's got her reasons for things, but I never can quite figure out what they are. Guys, that's the place. It's out of hand. Oh, shit. What a mess. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? <laughs> Mariana's tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! You're safe! I can't believe it! You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Block yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. I don't even know how long I was in there. I'm so sorry I left you behind. I've been trying to get back here this whole time. You don't have to be sorry. You said you'd come back, and you did. Kate. And your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh no. No. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. Mariana, stay back. It's a fucking way, lad. us. Hey, hey, it's 
okay. I got you. You happy to see me? <gasps> Gross. Come on. I think we get a pass. Oh. I wanted to come after you. I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. I thought we were done for. There's no way I would let that happen. Yeah, well, you weren't here. The herd showed up and Mariana was gone and we were waiting and, and waiting and then... I was just I'm so scared. I'm pretty sure that he I'm just told him that. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? She saved my life. Pulled this crazy stunt. Let me get the upper hand on the asshole who took me away from you guys. Her name's Clementine. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, <laughs> oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? I think so. Right, Trip? <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out. I thought you'd been to this place. I have. I just... I didn't have much time to relax in my jacuzzi suite. <laughs> you know? Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found him alive, healthy, reasonably cheerful. It's a hell of a thing. Well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woo-hoo about, that's all. Yeah, I should have went for Lucky or something. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten our arrangement. I know it's not the easiest thing to find, but... Cool. <laughs> Thanks. Holy shit! for all that, but not right now. Kate needs a doctor. Which means we gotta go. We got a window here, man. I'm gonna fucking kill him. I'm gonna kill all of them. You wanna die too? You think that's gonna help your little girl? So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you wanna do what's right for your family, you'll come with me. It's time to go, man. We stay here and we finish this. 
Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here right now! I already now. killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? No! Uh, Javi, you have to come with us! Javi, please! Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi! Please come with us! Please! Javi, come on! Cover the ass. Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi! Go with them. I'll be fine. Give me a hand here, kid. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. If we don't, these fuckers will just come after us again. <laughs> so what's the five percent one? was the walking dead episode one thank you very much for watching i have been Rakila. this has been the walking dead and until next time goodbye